What is up guys, it is BGA322, you are back with part 3 of my Banjo-Kazooie Let's Play, and last time we left off, we finished Treasure Trove Cove, and we are moving on to world number 3, which is Clanker's Cavern. Now, this world is interesting, it's probably one of my lesser favorite levels, mainly because it's a water level, and I'm not a big fan of water levels, as everyone knows. Um, this one isn't too bad because it's not like, it's not like it's just water. It could be much, much worse than it is. Uh, but it, it, it's definitely, uh, one of my lesser favorite levels in this game. Uh, and I'm really, this is usually the level that it happens to me on first because I get really reckless with, uh, with what I'm doing. But, uh, or I guess reckless isn't really the word. I guess more... I don't pay as much attention in this level for some reason, but um, if you do die in levels, uh, I, I think if you die, yeah, if you die, then uh, you, oh shoot, not paying attention, and fall damage, fantastic. Uh, if you die, you not only lose all of the Jinjos that you've collected in the world, but you also lose all of the notes that you've collected in a world, and trust me, having to go back and collect a hundred notes, especially in some of the later levels, is not very fun at all. And I would know, and so would anyone else who's played this game for that matter. You know how frustrating that can be. You go- oh, damn it! I, oh, oh, there's a honeycomb back here. I think I've said it before, but this is the reason I like Banjo-Kazooie, because the honeycombs stay where they are. And I need that note. Because <laughs> I don't want to end up I don't want to end up with 99 and then be like, where the hell is that last note? Just to realize that it's at the beginning of the level. So it's happened before. It's happened. Die. Ah, oh, too low. Whatever, at least I fell in water. That's always nice. Alrighty, now that we have everything in this little area here, we're going to head over to the main area of the actual level. Which is this area over here. And I'm not 100% sure what I want to do first while we're here. Um... But, this right here is one of the things that scared me as a child. Oh my god, that is so freaking vicious. Uh, this is Clanker. Um, yeah, he's a base... Banjo, don't go through that pipe. He's basically a uh, trash compactor. And Gruntilda is forcing him to compact the trash. Now, we are going to be raising him up in just a second here. I just have to do this at the right angle so that I don't uh, get myself killed because that would be fantastic. However, there is... All right, let's do this. Uh, we have to go all the way down to the bottom down here and there's like a key at the bottom that we have to go through three times. So again, with the three times thing. Uh, and running out of air usually happens quite a bit, but at least there is a fish down here that will... Okay, keep, uh, there is a fish down here that will allow me to, uh, get some air back, which is gonna be really nice, because there are notes down here that I am going to have to get, and, you know, kind of mandatory, because we need a hundred notes. And that is three, this is going to raise Planker for us. I'm down to three health here, uh, there you are, Mr. Fish, you want to give me, uh, some health, that would be fantastic, or oxygen, I guess, would be the correct term, because it's not really health. And I can't remember what it is in this game. I can't remember if uh, running out of oxygen starts taking health off, or where did you go? Where did you go? Oh, God, no. Where would you go? Where would you go? Where would you go? Where would you, you go? Oh, jeez. Okay, not going to deal with this. I'm just going to go up and get air because I really don't want to die. I'm pretty sure if you run out of oxygen, it just starts taking off health like it does in the second game. Uh, I'm not going to chance it, though. Uh, I'd rather... Oh, jeez, I'm down to one. I'm down to one. Go, Banjo, go! Oh god, that was close. Okay, okay. We need to get these notes down here. So we are, and there's a ginger down there too, for that matter, actually. So we have to get that as well. But this part always scares me because I hate doing this part. It's one of my least favorite things about this level. The, the, this level is in, in there, right there. As you can see, he's spitting out these little air bubbly things, and they will give me back oxygen, which is nice. 
Okay, gonna grab this ginger down here. Ah, gotcha. Alrighty. Alrighty, one note. So, it's been established that I need at least three to make it back up. Need to get this oxygen. Alrighty. I know I missed one behind me. I missed two behind me, but I'm not turning around to get it. I'll just go around the loop again. I missed three. Oh, shoot. Gonna grab this air bubble. Come on, get it. Thank you. Isn't this exciting, guys? Isn't this the funnest thing you've ever done? Don't worry, it gets a lot more tedious later. Okay, I need to find you, Mr. Fish, because I need air. Air is a wonderful thing to have. I think that's everything. Get this. And, yep, it looks like that is all the notes, so let's just head on up. And not die. Isn't this wonderful, guys? See, it's good when you can not drown in uh, trash-infested waters. Alrighty, we're gonna knock out this back here first. But I pretty much plan on doing everything on the uh, outer side before we head in. Uh, to Clanker himself because there is another section inside of him which is, you know, fantastic. Alrighty, uh, this back here, um... No, hello. Snippet Mutants are we. Jigsaw is ours. Fight us, you... something, something, something. Oh god, they're everywhere! Oh, oh, oh! Oh, that was close. Alrighty. And this is going to give us a jiggy. Hooray. Yep. Exciting stuff, guys. Exciting stuff. I'm really in one of those I have no idea what to talk about moves. So I really don't know what to talk about. I'm technically officially done school. That's nice. <laughs> That's nice. Uh, other than exams and stuff. Like, today was the last day pretty much, which is um, always good. Because, you know, who likes school, honestly? Okay, um, I can't remember exactly where this is. I know, I'm, I'm pretty sure we have to go through both of them anyway. Uh, one of these has a Jiggy at the end of it, and one of them has a Jinjo, but I don't know exactly which is which. Hey, Jiggy, how's it going? Alrighty. And... Uh, the one on the other side, uh, there's another pipe like this one, is actually going to lead us to the blue ginger, I think? I think that's right. Oh, running out of air. That is not good. Actually, you know what, maybe I can do this before I head down that way. Oh, there is no this. Never mind. Let us head down. Uh, but yeah, I think this is just going to lead us to a blue Jinju, if I'm correct. I'm really glad they didn't put notes in this pipe. Yeah, here it is, blue Jinju. And I don't think there's anything at the end of this one, unless it just loops around, which it does. Those are just feathers. I know one of these pipes has notes in it. Because it's just what the game likes to do. It's got to be this one back here. Nope, golden feathers. Which we don't need yet, which means that, that pipe over there has to have them, but I'm just going to come up and grab some air here. And we will come down and get these notes, providing there are notes here. If there aren't, then I have no idea why I thought there was. It's just one of those, one of those things. I just remember there being notes under, yeah, see, right here. Good, good. I'm not going crazy, guys. I still know this. Seven. What a random number. Seven notes. 
Alrighty, um... Okay, you need to come up so we can get up here. Oh, no, 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 oh, dang it, that wasn't supposed to happen. Yep, just wait. This is just this is exciting, isn't it, guys? I really don't know what to talk about for this part. There isn't really much about this level that I... Oh, oh, I didn't go far enough. There isn't much about this level that I really had to talk about, so I don't, I don't know what to talk about. I could have gone that way. What am I going this... Oh, I know why I'm going this way. There's a very simple reason to why I'm going this way. Okay, we're going to have to come back up here. First of all, I believe this is the honeycomb. There is one of our honeycombs for this world, guys. Now we have to come back up here, not only because we have to go the other way, but because there's a Jinjo up there as well, I think. If not, then there is stuff in that uh, grate that we did not get before. So apparently we're going to be coming back this way, not just this time, but again, we have to come back to this spot. Wait, shut up, I hear you! Thank you. Now I don't think there's anything here. Yeah, just eggs, I don't care about Ah, ah! Oh, a life that I don't need. Thanks, life. Alrighty, whatever. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna come up this way. Now I don't know. I can't remember if that's important or not. I know where the other honeycomb is. I can't remember if there's anything up here or not, though. That is important, though, apparently. Got some notes. Notes are nice. Oh, this part here, yeah. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, yeah, no. Oh, shoot. That wasn't supposed to happen. There's a mumbo token up there. I want that. I just want to see if there's anything up here. For some reason, I think there is. Oh! There's our second honeycomb piece, guys. Why did I think that it was a different place? Huh. Well, uh, that is our two honeycomb pieces for this world. They're right beside each other, so, you know, it shouldn't be that hard to get. So, you know, get them. Because they're right beside each other. For some- oh no, where I- one of the Jinjos is where I thought- Damn it, I keep fucking doing that. Uh, where one of the Jinjos is is where I thought the, uh, where I thought the honeycomb was. And I'll point that out when we go there. Because, you know, if there's a Jinjo there, we kind of have to go there. Okay, I am- oh! Are you- what? Whoa, 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 what happened, man? I was clearly, clearly I was on that, and it, it just let go for me. It, it just let go for me. Uh, this is gonna be uh, pipe climbing with uh, banjo. That's all this game is, is pipe pipe climbing. It's a it's, it's new banjo game. Would have been, uh, I'm gonna make it, put it into production. Uh, Banjo's pipe climbing adventure. It's gonna be much, much better than uh, banjo nuts and bolts. And yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll just go from, we'll go from there and see what happens. All right, I think that's everything on at least regarding the down there, so we're just gonna come on up here and grab uh, all these notes. As well as this jiggy here. Thank you. And... Oh, don't fall, don't fall. Ah, this jiggy up here. And there's one more jiggy we need to get, but we need to come down here and grab these notes first. Oh, and this mumbo token, apparently. Ha! Sucker, not gonna get me this time. Alrighty, 66 notes. Not bad, actually. And we're just gonna grab one more puzzle piece up here before... Stupid Finn! I don't want to dive. Oh. I didn't want that to happen either, because I don't want to go inside of you yet. No! Stop. God damn it, stop diving! Stop going under the Finn banjo. Not cool. Alrighty, uh, last one we need is just over here. Okay, good. Let me just stand on top of this. 
Alrighty. Oh, sad face. Sad face. Don't go under. Good. Good job, Banjo. Good job. Oh, shoot. This also always creeps me out. His eyes follow you. You're just creepy, man. Alright, let's try and do this without failing this time. Alright, I believe this is our fifth one. So yeah, there are, if I'm correct, five jiggies on the outside, the exterior of the level, and five jiggies on the interior of the bow of the level. Um, yes, next thing we need to do is, we're just gonna look this way first of all. Gonna, there we go. Gotta aim at these golden cheats here and hit them with three eggs. Uh, there is one on each side. One's gonna lead to a mumbo token, and the one on the other side is going to lead to a puzzle piece, uh, as soon as we unlock it, which we're going to go do now. Which would be much easier if I could see. It would be much easier if he would stay up to make things much, much easier. There we go. Oh wait, there's something behind me. Come out, just golden feathers. They don't matter. And this one is going to lead us to a Jiggy, which is Jiggy number one of five within the exterior of the level. And if we just drop down here, we are going to come upon some crabs, oh god. But, more importantly, we are going to come across some notes. And notes are nice, nice things. Alright, nothing there, but if we come this way... I love how every time you go underwater, the music just turns into this eerie, eerie, awesomeness. Ow. Alright, now I don't think I can get the one I want to get yet, unless... Yeah, I can't get up here yet, can I? I think it's in this one. I can't cheat. Um, but I do need these notes down here. And you're not going out. Alrighty, this is a fun mini game, one that I am not quite fond of. Um, you guys know I use the term fun very sarcastically quite often. Uh, but it's it's not all that challenging. It's it, it, it's it's a. Uh, I can't remember if it's in any other parts of the game, but uh, I know in Banjo Tooie it's actually used as its own mini game. Like there's a mini game made out of it, which is pretty fun in this. Ow, which is pretty fun in the uh, second one, but in this one it's just meh. It's just meh. Oh, I'm going the wrong way, man. I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> For some reason, I always think that if you run out of time on this, Flanker's just gonna like self-destruct and you're gonna die. I don't know why I think that, I just do. And upon getting all the rings, the uh, water will rise, which is going to allow us to not only get this Jiggy, but it's going to allow us to get the uh, final Jinjo that we need, as well as a flight pad that's on the other side, which is apparently what we need to get this. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> Alrighty, that is seven. And we can also get these notes over here. Now this is where, uh, this is where I thought the other honeycomb piece was, because right down here, if we just come down this way, you'll see that the pink Jinjo is down here. And I always, I always, always, oh, always end up getting that one last, and it always freaks me out, because I'm just like, wait, is there a note over here? No, there isn't. Okay. It always freaks me out because I'm just like, uh, yeah, that tentacle thing down there is going to kill me. Alrighty, you know, over the here, like I was saying, there is a flight pad, which is going to be very useful. Because this 
is going to allow us to... Oh, God, thank you, Christ. This is gonna... Oh, God, don't hit that. This is gonna allow us to come up to this section right here. I keep thinking I can press B. I can't press B! Hey, Mumbo, how's it going? This move uses Biko's wings as a shield against the bad guys. Cool, does it make me invulnerable? Sure does. Hold Z and press the right C button. Alright guys, this is the Golden Feather move, which is actually not called that. I can't remember what it's called. I never know what... I, I don't know what like any of the moves are called. I hope you guys know that. I think I made that pretty clear on the... Uh, like on the first episode, is that I have no idea what any of the move names are. But yeah, as you can see, using the Golden Feathers, we are completely uh, invulnerable to these blades here. And we can just cross over and get Jiggy number 9. Now, I should have gotten the other one before I came in here, and foolishly I didn't. But uh, I kind of went with doing the teeth first. And I don't usually. So what we're going to do is if we just come this way, uh, we actually have to just exit Clanker uh, before we can get to where we need to get. So I'm just going to come up this way here so we can exit. And what we actually have to do is, uh, you guys remember the uh, blowhole where we uh, where we got that jiggy at the front of uh, Clanker's body? Yeah, that's, uh, that's where we have to go. We have to go down there. And that's basically going to allow us to uh, get our final jiggy for the level. And not only that, but it is also going to give us this switch right here, as well as our final notes. Uh-oh, I'm missing notes. That's not good. I'm missing two notes. Where the hell am I missing two notes from? I told you guys this was going to happen. They weren't on the other side, were they? Because that would make me very, very sad. They weren't on the other side. Okay, that's gonna lead me to the other thing. Where? Ow. Where's this gonna lead me? Oh, uh oh. Ow. Don't die, Banjo. I don't wanna get all this again. Where's this lead? Dun, dun, dun. Oh, it leads down this way. Okay. Uh, I'm missing notes. Where am I missing notes from? This isn't good, guys. This is this 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 is yeah, grah, blah, blah. This is bad. This is very very bad. I don't know where I'm missing notes from, and it's only two, and then this is oh god. Oh god, no! Oh jeez, can't die, can't die. Oh god, oh god, I need a beehive. Where's a beehive when you need one? Where are these damn notes when you need them? As long as I find them, I don't care if I die. But I don't. God damn it. I need some crabs, man. Oh god, no! I don't know where they are. Well, this isn't good. Huh. Alrighty, well, time to recap every area. Okay, well, they may be at the beginning, that is always possible. Um, is, no, it's only two, they wouldn't be down there. Oh, 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 I know where they are, guys. I know where they are. I got this, don't worry, I got this. Uh, I need to go over there. See, I'm smart, guys, I'm smart, I remember this kind of stuff. I remember. And there's a beehive over here, awesome! Not only is there a beehive, but there's also an enemy, which is, means I'm gonna get four. Ah! Yes, life. Alrighty, uh, if we just come on up here, we got a shock pad. And note number one. I think they're both up here. <laughs> if there's only one note up here, I, no, the second one's over there. I was gonna say, if there's only one note up here, I'm gonna be very, very disappointed. Alrighty, all 100 notes, and that's just a pointless life, and I really don't care, so it doesn't matter. 
But we're gonna head out of this level because we're done, guys. That is everything for Clanker's Cavern. I'm doing pretty good. I'm averaging a level per episode right now, which is pretty nice. Uh, that, that's gonna change pretty quickly, I'm sure. As you can tell, the uh, time's been going up quite a bit for these levels uh, during each part, so, you know. But everything is good. We have everything in this level. It's fantastic. Means I can get out of here and never ever come back. Because I hate this level. Not actually. It's not a bad level. I, I wouldn't say any of the levels are bad. There are just ones I prefer more than others. The next level... Oh god, the next level is awful. And when I say awful, I don't mean like awful. I mean like... Yeah... Yeah... Uh, I just don't like it that much. Although the music's good. I like the music. Kind of. It's not the best music in the game, but it's not the worst. If that, says, if, if that means anything. Uh, anyways, uh, the grunty switch that we got in Clanker's Cavern, if you guys remember the puzzle piece for Treasure Trove Co., which is right over there, is actually where we need to be. As you can see, the two eyes are popped out. If you just ground pound on two of them, a jiggy will appear in the center. And that is going to give us our jiggy for this world. And that is Overworld Jiggy number 4 of 10. Now, the next place we need to go, if you guys remember, before we headed into Clanker's Cavern during the last episode, well, before I went to Clanker's Cavern during the last episode, this note door up right, right here, uh, we can now open, well, we could have opened it before, because it only takes uh, 180 to open, and since we have 300, we're pretty good. So, uh, yeah, we're, we're heading towards the next level, guys. Uh, that fish right there, very annoying. But if we just head up this way here... You guys are going to notice that we're in a pretty swampy area. Ouch, that sucks. Dang piranha, this is piranha water. Keep your smelly feet out. Yeah, whatever. As you guys can see, uh, this is our next level, Bubble Gloop Swamp. Now, if you don't know how we got here or how we opened the door, it's because I did it in the last part, not this part. So, if you want to know, you got to go back to part two, because that's when I did it. Anyways, uh, for now, this is VGA322 signing out. Next time, we'll be heading to Bubble Gloop, bu blah, 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 Bubble Gloop Swamp. Next time, we'll be heading to Bubble Gloop Swamp. There we go. I hope you guys enjoyed this part, but until then, peace.